I'm not paying you, just look at my homework. Sorry, sorry. You know what'll happen if you don't do it, right? Yes, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll do it. Just remember, you can go in all of your homework. How do you hear about this guy again? Come on, dude. Seriously? The guy famous all over campus for shrieking whenever he sees a piece of bread coming at him? Everybody knows him. Oh, yeah, well, why'd you bring him along? Remember the homework? And you need to constantly keep an eye on him? Yeah. Mostly, though. I mean, come on, man. It's funny as hell to see him spread around this stuff. True that. You got the boost? The only, only reason I got that damn bread was to scare you, right? Hey man, it's good. Just give me a minute, alright? Ugh, oh, seriously, dude? Hey, Clark! You hear that whole thing in the news? Bread killing people? Don't worry, dude. Even though we got a full loaf of bread right over here, I'll make sure nothing happens to you. Are you talking about that thing with the knives and the bread? It seems like a dumb tabloid story. People maliciously putting knives in bread. Yeah, I know, but did you see the look on his face? Fools! You do not even understand me. Who are you? In a tale not many would tell. It's been stowed away for years. Just saying it strikes fear into the hearts of the listeners. What the hell are you talking Don't ruin my moment! It was an ordinary night for the old doctor. His experimental and unregulated work evaded the government for a long time. He finally perfected his magnum opus, and he was so close to his end goal. Unfortunately, his past finally caught up with him. FBI, open up! You'll never take me alive! as to what happened to the doctor that night. But the limbs were all tied back to him. Nobody even knows where the bite marks came from. But, honestly, they didn't even care. They thought, oh, look, we're rid of the old doctor. But, what if that's what he wanted all along? Why the hell did you learn that? I'm part of a cabal of secret brilliant minds that talk about things that people of average IQ level wouldn't really understand. What's the name of this cabal? 4chan. Okay. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. I ain't doing it here with this weirdo. What? Yo, get lost. I must stay for the ascension. Nah, that's it. I'm out of here. No way. Dude. What? Dude. Dude. Just for the road. Dude. 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 Halt! It is imperative that you stay. What? Why? You will learn if you are patient. God, I didn't think the one would be this intolerant. But maybe there is another. Oh, oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh! The bread's moving, the bread's moving, the bread's moving! Oh, oh, oh. It was a little bit earlier than I expected. What the heck did you just do? <sighs> I didn't do anything, alright? Listen, as long as I have this, we'll be fine. The literature predicted this. Just let me eat my sandwich, okay? Damn kids telling me what to do.
Hey, Katie, you all right? I'm all right. Ah, oh, great. Now the bloke is what we really need. Shut it, Gramps. Don't worry about him. The name's Basta. I'm Clark. Ah, <coughs> oh, sure, not again. It'd be really helpful if she wasn't here anymore. Shut up! You don't even know half the pain she's going through. You realize you should be dead now, right? What? You were left over. That wasn't supposed to happen. I took the chance and got lucky. That one bimbo here was fine enough. I should have just strangled her and been done with everything, but no. Then he came. Then one more shithead I gotta deal with. It doesn't matter though. I need to do this. I need to do this. I need to do this. Are you gonna betray us? Uh, no. Hey, knock it off! I don't need that look from anyone. It's okay, Molly. Everything will be fine. What happened? Well, it's better for yourself for yourself. Uh, ah! What the hell happened? I don't know. I just walked in here and saw Molly crying over and over again. What do you mean? Isn't this your house? No. I was running in the street just like yourself. And I was fighting off those pesky birds. I saw this door open and bolted in. I saw Mr. Grumpy Pants here and Molly. Why don't you shut your mouth? Oh, teasing can't hurt. Okay, well, obviously she's connected to this place. Maybe we should ask her what to do. Good idea. I'll ask. Uh, well, that's easier said than done, don't you think? Nah, just watch me. Molly, can you tell us what happened? Sure, what do you need to know? Yeah, her emotional range is either complete joy, complete sadness, or just complete staring, I guess. Uh, I'll go cover the body. Okay. So, Molly, what happened and how did you get here? Well, I was coming to visit my friend, and apparently he was dead. Eaten by the bread? Well, what are you gonna do? Are you schizophrenic? Well, does it look like I have any on me? What happened? I think she needs to go. Shut it! The bigger the group we are, the easier we survive. Okay, I still have several questions. Never mind that. We need weapons. I got this bat on my truck to fight off those pesky vermin. But we're gonna need some more weapons to defend y'all. Shouldn't we board the doors and the windows first? Yeah, that bread's really gonna break in here. All right, jeez. Let's go upstairs. Hey, why aren't they gonna help us? Well, for Molly, with her type of emotional range, she's kind of a dead weight. Or, hell, even worse, a complete nuisance. Don't you know the female stereotype in black and white cinema? I get that, but what about with Lou? Ah, he's just an asshole. He's not just an asshole, I think he's gonna kill us. <laughs> Nah, he's not gonna kill us. I mean, he mumbled something about it, but I don't believe it. What, and you're fine with that? What's wrong with you? Throw him out already! Well, you know what they say. Live, laugh, love. What does it have to do with anything? Ah, uh, forget it. We just need to find some weapons. What? Okay.
you knuckleheads come down now! So remember to stay home and make no attempt to leave. In urgent news, this just in. Safe houses have been established for locals to take refuge in. We will spend the remainder of this broadcast to announce where current safe houses are located. Okay, cool. Main Boulevard, Main Avenue, Main Street. What the hell? All these names are terrible. Don't sit on the fucking broadcast. We fucking... What? What? Do it? what? what? Why not? Right, What's wrong right. with it? Who's a... Car! Oh, this is wonderful! Oh, ah, 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 Trying to sandwich me. It's toast. It's really good. Shit. What the hell happened? There was just bread out of the cabinets. Oh no. They're learning. Now we have to go. We aren't going anywhere. We'll stay put and then we'll see where we're going. This bullshit again? Nothing's been working out. What are you talking about? We've been doing pretty dang well compared with- Don't you get it? It's been you this whole time. You've hindered us beyond redemption. How can we come back from this? What? You haven't had enough, have you? I bet it was you, you, who put that bread all in there. It was Molly's friend who put the bread there. Is that all you care about? This wasn't supposed to happen. I was supposed to come out on top. Now you've ruined everything. What are you talking about? Wait, the missing link. Yeah, I know who it is. It was you all along. The prophecy was right. I just misinterpreted it. I know I could still be the one. All right, get off your high horse. I know what to do now. No! Uh, why are you doing this? The prophecy needs to be fulfilled. That makes no sense. Not only are you hindering your ability to survive by killing one of the members of your team, who also happens to be the strongest, but you're also wasting precious time, energy, and resources. You could have taken me inside, stripped me of my clothing, put stab me, and then pushed me outside. But now you're gonna kill me, and for what? Uh, uh, uh. Ah, oh, son of a. I'm in charge now, got that? Uh, okay, okay, okay. All right, the first course of action is, hmm, I actually never thought this far. Whatever. All right, Minion, what's the first course of action? Uh, uh I don't know. Enough already, tell me right now. The board of the doors and windows? You imbecile. How many times do I have to tell you? Those stupid pieces of bread will not break. <laughs> Oh my god, Jesus Christ, why'd that have to happen? We're so screwed, I, um, I almost died, I, I almost, you almost died, what the hell? Oh shit. Are you alright? 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 How can I be alright with everything that just happened? How can you be alright with everything that just happened? Forget the other guys, you should be crying your guts out! Oh man... 
I should be upset? Oh, no, no, no. Don't do what I'm thinking. I, I should be upset. No, no, no. No, don't, don't I, be upset. I should be upset. No, hey, it's okay. Think of sunshine. I should be upset. Oh, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> Jesus, dude, what are you doing? No. Toast. It's really good. <coughs> Use the elements. Who are you? I am Dr. Rizafe Salonifer. Call me Dr. R. And I definitely know you were one who's heard of the prophecy. What? How the hell do you know my name? Uh, I predicted this day would come. I was the man who mutated the form of the bread. It was all going perfectly until the goddamn FBI showed up and ruined everything. And at least they thought I was gonna like do something like it was like, oh, you're gonna sell it to the highest bidder, we can't trust you with the like, I don't know, it's all crap. Anyway, I had to seal it away for a long time and, you know, seal it into the atmosphere. Uh, and, you know, I predicted it was gonna just, you know, it was gonna mutate the bread on this day. So, yeah, here we are. That doesn't make sense. Oh, jeez, you know, the fool, the morons are always the ones who are in denial. Like, you, know, you should know this crap already. Why? I don't know why I'm telling you this. You're, like, you're supposed to be one of the most brilliant scientists of all time because the prophecy said you're supposed to be the most brilliant scientist. How would you know either way? What are you talking about? Everyone on 4chan knows what this is. 4chan? The, the, the guy he sent it to told me he would like, he'd be, like he sent it to the society of the most brilliant minds of all time. Yeah, that's 4chan. Look, why are you doing this and what do I have to do with this? I'm, I'm a nobody. Well, that's where you're wrong, Clark. Because you, Clark, you are my son. What? It is true. I never met you! Why? Why all this? Well, I wanted to teach you a lesson. What? I wanted to teach you to have some confidence. That's it? Yeah. Is this a joke? Uh, don't, don't be rude like that, okay? I work really hard on this. Right, so you should, the most people we thank for. I don't know what you're being ungrateful for. How did you know I was so unconfident as a baby? Um, I, uh, I uh, use science. How? Um, astrological science. What the hell? I mean, look, dude, you gotta admit, when you're going out there with like the bread, you know, finding them all, like that was pretty cool. You know what I mean? Yeah. Killing all the bread. Yeah. You know, it made you feel like Gotta a badass. Admit, I feel more confident. I yeah, mean, I feel yeah. like a total badass. Yeah, right? you know, like you know, here's, you know, here's the thing, Clark. You know, when I was your age, I, uh, I didn't, I never really was able to feel confidence either. You know, I, like I never really, never really was able to, never really was able to bond with anyone. You know, I just, I just didn't want to go, I just didn't want my son to go through that. You know, I just want to, I just want you to be able to bond. You know. It's, you know, that's great and all, but couldn't you have done this in a better way? What? Like, you know, you could have built up my confidence without starting the apocalypse. I mean, have you seen the streets? There are dead bodies littered all over. Uh, nah, that's lame. <laughs> You're right, it would be lame. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm just wondering, how did you make it here through all that bread? Well, I always got a trick on my ass. I, um, I brought a cure. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. Well, son, looks like there are more of them. What do you say we take them on? Yeah, you got it. All right, let's go. Atta boy.
So, um, you want to go see a movie? Dude, you destroyed the planet. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs>